Okay, so um, I talked last week in the Ed slot about the work we do outside of this meeting. So what were, one of the, what were some of the key things I talked about that we can do to make sure BNI is working for us? Outside of this meeting. One-to-ones. One-to-ones. Thank you very much. I'm so glad you're here because no one else was listening last week, apparently. Um, one-to-ones. What is the purpose of a one-to-one? Find out about other people's business. Find out about business. What was that, James? To generate referrals for each other. Yeah? To find out about each other's business, but to generate referrals. Now, there are two types of referrals in BNI that we talk about. We've got our bread and butter referrals. What are they? Just stuff that keeps us ticking over. Yeah. The general day to day jobs we do, the thing that pays the bills, pays the staff, um, keeps the business going. And then we've got our golden goose referrals, as they say. What, what are they? Yeah. Just to make sure, you know, it hits the jackpot. Yeah, so they're the big opportunities, the big referrals, the big introductions that can transform your business and take it to the next level. Hit those business goals that you've got. So when we're having a one-to-one, -one, if you're new to the chapter, you're new to B&I, you're meeting some people for the first time, the first goal of our one-to-one -one should be to get to know each other. Agreed? Mm -hmm. So we, we can build some trust <coughs> in each other. We understand that I like Dave. I think he's going to do a good job for me, but I know the services he offers. So when an opportunity comes up to refer and introduce Dave, I've got the confidence to say, you know what, Dave's a great sparky, his team can handle that for you. Whether that's a moving a socket, rewiring a house, installing a fire alarm, whatever it might be. Okay, I've got the confidence that Dave can sort that for that person and I can refer it. But really, we'd all like more of those golden goose referrals, wouldn't we? So how do we get those? Can I give you three questions to ask in your one-to-ones that might help you generate more of those for people? Well, everyone's getting their pens out. You are, li you are listening. Okay, so have your one-to-one. -one. Find out about each other's business. Get to know each other personally. But then ask each other these questions. What's the one thing in your business that you are focused on working on right now? What's that one goal you're trying to hit? Phrase it however you like, but what's the, what's the one thing that you, you're striving towards? Second question, who would you like an introduction to to help make that happen? What type of person, what type of introduction, who, who can help you get to that goal? And then thirdly, how can I introduce you to that person? What do I need to say to them to put you in front of them? What benefits do you bring to that person to help me open the door? And then before you wrap up your one-to-one, -one, sit down and go through your, through your phone, through your contact list, and see if there's anybody in there that you could introduce that person to right there and right then. Because if you got to know somebody, you know them well, especially on your second, third one-to-ones with people, you should have the confidence now to pick up the phone or <coughs> type an email there and then say, look, can I introduce you to so-and-so? So what's the one thing you're working on? Who can I introduce you to to make that happen? And how do I introduce you? And then be proactive with it. Take 30 seconds, a couple of minutes, and see who you know to help that person there and then. That's all for this week. Thank you. <laughs>